Hello everyone, this is another video regarding Cisco A91 FW. In this video I'm going to show you how to connect from the router to the access point which is part of that box. Why I'm saying this? Because normally you have a console port on the device where you can plug it in Cisco cable, Cisco console cable and you can connect directly but in this situation there is no separate console port uh, for the access point what you have to do you have to actually connect through the router to the access point using telnet connection so there is a command which needs to be executed on the on the uh, device on the router and this command is a uh, this one as you can see service module WLAN dash AP zero session and right now we're not able to do so because there is no IP address configured on that interface so what we have to do we need to configure that interface put the IP address on it and try to connect it okay so let's let's do that Conf T IP address. <coughs> oh, maybe the interface first. Interface and now you can see this this interface is used only for the managing purposes to connect to the access point. Okay, so now we're going to use the IP address. This IP address could be any IP address, it doesn't really matter, it's not routable on the internet, it's just only for this uh, connection or connectivity uh, purposes. So what we have to do is just uh, put the IP address, IP address, I'm going to use this one, it really doesn't matter, you can just use any. Uh, and 32 bit mask okay so we got the IP address now and let's try to connect once again using the same command you see co connection has been refused and uh, for some time I couldn't figure it out where the problem was but finally I've managed and what we have to do, if you do show run begin line, we've got this line too. And what we have to do, we need to add one command on this line and be able to connect to the access point. So how are we going to do that? What is the command? It's a very simple one, conf t transport uh, line sorry line to transport input all that's it and now if you execute this command once again we got a prompt from the access point so if we hit the enter once again we got a access point so by default uh, there is a password on the access point and the password is Cisco capital C so C I S C O and we got a prompt so show run by default there is no configuration on the on the access point if you raise the config and reload the box this is the basic one that you can get so we've got a username cisco and password cisco and also we got this enable secret which is cisco over here so this is the default configuration okay so we got this and now we are on the access point so how are we going to escape and go back to the router cli so Control shift 6 X and now we are on the router but when we you hit the enter once again 
it will be taken back to the access point so how are we going to do that i mean disconnect from the access point yes we're going to execute another command so exit so now we are on the access point uh, on, on the console cable so we got a prompt from the console cable and to go back control shift 6 x and to break this connection we're going to use this command disconnect and now we are on the router so this is this exactly works as a telnet connection as you can see it so now what we're going to do we're going to save this oh sorry uh, copy run start so configuration has been saved and now if we do once again show IP interface brief we can see this IP address over here for managing access point and also if you do show run begin line we have this extra command on the line too okay that was it for this video hopefully you enjoyed it and see you on the next one